Tuesday's footy news here on afl.com.au. Hello, everyone. I'm Matt Thompson. Now, by his own admission, Chris Judd says he hasn't had the best of pre-seasons, but he is ready to go, he says, for the opening clash against the Tigers. Entering the last year of his current contract, Judd hopes to have a new deal signed before the end of the season. Look, I mean, the, the twilight years, I'm not buying my bananas green, put it that way. But, um, <laughs> but by the same token, I think I've still got some good games left and, and can really contribute to the club. I don't envisage any more... Uh, for the Tigers, there's hype as always, desperately hoping to avoid another demolition at the hands of the Blues. We're certainly looking forward to a great contest. You know, our list has improved again. They've got further experience. We think we're better prepared. So, look, overall, we think it's going to be a good result for us going into round one. Look, you, you can always look back in the past and find, you know, certain situations we hadn't played well. All we worried about is our pre-season form. Dale Thomas will also be at the MCG on Thursday night, playing in a curtain raiser for the Magpies VFL side. Luke Ball is still about a month away, but Darren Jolly will be right. Nathan Buckley says he won't be playing anyone who's not ready. We're not going to rush players back in that, that haven't had um, a solid block of training. The intensity is going to be high and North Melbourne are a hard running side and um, you know, showed us up in round 21 last year, so we've got some work to do. It's been a long journey, but after his NAB Cup brilliance, Majak Dor is finally a chance to debut for North Melbourne. And we think he's, a, he's an absolutely viable option for us now, so I'm not just using coaching cliches when I say he's in the mix. He's genuinely uh, in the mix. Now in Sydney, would you believe they are preparing for the Battle of the Bridge and Kevin Sheedy is dreaming about beating the reigning premiers? Wouldn't it be great to see the Giants beat the premiership side? Well, it'd be extraordinary, but I don't think anyone will be tipping you. That's OK. I don't have a problem with that. That even makes it better because I think that, um, you know, Premiership, wooden spoon, I'm not quite sure where the gap's that far. Yeah, look, I think they're a much improved side but what I've seen over this pre-season campaign. Uh, they're, they're working hard, they're hard at the ball, so it's going to be, it's going to be a very tough game. They're, they're going to be, you know, fierce competitors. The Western Bulldogs have been caught a bit off guard with the extent of skipper Matthew Boyd's injury. Uh, he's just got a little nick in his calf. We thought it was a cork and then it didn't respond and... Uh, further investigation, so a little nick, maybe two or three weeks. Robert Murphy will captain the side in his absence. And after nine frustrating months, Demons big man Mitch Clark has pulled up well from his hit out in a VFL practice match. Oh yeah, you go through a few dark times there. Um, it's, a, it's a long, long hard battle in rehab. A call yet to be made on whether Mitch Clark plays on Sunday. That is our report for now. This is afl.com.au, the place where footy news happens.